Veterans are disappointed at the governor's recent veto of funding that would have provided extra housing for elderly veterans here at this Butte Veterans Home. Uh, it was a, a punch in the gut. Uh, the governor doesn't really realize what he's done to the veterans of the state of Montana. Governor Greg Gianforte removed $6 million from House Bill 5 that would have built a sixth cottage at the Southwest Montana Veterans Home in Butte that would have added 12 rooms for veterans. Veteran home officials believe the veto was not necessary. You're talking about House Bill 5 being over a billion dollars of, of state funded projects. Six million is a drop in the bucket. The governor justified the veto, stating the federal government should help pay for this project instead of the entire bill falling on the state. In a statement from Gianforte, House Bill 5 appropriates $6 million for the project, leaving Montana taxpayers crossing our fingers that the federal government might reimburse us once we've spent the money. That, however, is not a wise strategy, and I will not hold my breath that the federal government will repay the state any portion. However, some believe the veto shows a lack of respect for Montana's veterans. It's a slap in the face of those that have given us our country and ensure our freedoms. We need to safeguard them. These people have safeguarded this country. We now, it's our turn to repay them. Veteran home officials are asking voters to reach out to their representatives and ask them to overturn the veto. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.